first first rule of trading mindset is don't get lost in the numbers okay and i'm going to read out to you something that's very very important and i and i've been through this as well in my journey okay it says many new traders come technically prepared but not emotionally prepared things might go well at the start but when a big loss hits many new traders lack the emotional strength to stomach it well. This inexperience pushes many to act hastily and change their setups. The problem with this is, is just because they lost a trade, it doesn't mean there is something dramatically wrong with their setups. Whereas seasoned traders will be confident in their plans and realize that it takes time for things to develop. Trading psychology teaches us that it's about long-term growth, not quick, instant gratification. Once the trader realizes it's okay to have a loss in the short term because we're actually focused on the long term, the big picture, right? Sorry, it says, once you realize it's okay to have a loss in the short term, it should, it should say because we're actually focused on the long term and the big picture, right? So... Don't get lost in the numbers of trading, right? A lot of you right now, you're starting in your journey and, and I've put together a, a, a launch system where every single one of you, if you're new, you would have received the, the instructions. Let me know in the chat box if you're new and you've been set up effectively in the academy. If you've been set up successfully with the system that we've put together, right? Um, you should have been able to create your account, create your demo account, create your live account, and then connect it to the broker, okay? So when it comes down to trading, okay, you must do your very, very best, okay, to avoid those emotions that can actually damage your, your whole career, right? Trading is a career. And I want you guys to really start to look at it as an actual career, okay? It's not just looking at a bunch of charts and copying and pasting signals. It's a career. I've made a career out of the trading industry. Now, I haven't always been, and I'm still not, the best trader in the world. I don't want to be the best trader in the world. I make money from investing. I'm smart at investing. I'm a networker by, by, by profession. That's, that's my strength. But I've understood over the years... If I'm going to uh, really multiply the money, because what happens is, and this is a very transparent, I'm a little bit, a little bit of a different vibe there. I'm, I'm gonna give you guys a, a real conversation type thing, right? Um, a lot of people, when they get involved in this industry, they make money from the networking or from the business side, but they squander it. They blow the money, designer clothes, all this rubbish. It doesn't even make you any more money. And one of the things that I'm grateful that I done when I, when, when, when I hit my first six figures in income, which was tw in, the, in the year 2020, I cleared six figures in that year, right? For the first time ever. And that year, what I done, right? Is I made a decision that I'm gonna invest a lot of that money into the Forex market, right? I'm gonna invest it into cryptos and I was able to do that, right? Now, there was a psychological block because I was getting lost in the numbers. I was getting lost in the numbers when I first got involved in trading. I'm going to tell you guys right now, don't get lost in the numbers. And the way that you have emotional strength to succeed in the trading world is personal development. Okay? Someone put that in the chat. Right? So I'll put that in the chat. Personal development. All right? Personal development. I'm really breaking it down tonight because I want... As we go into this new launch, as we go into September the 3rd, um, you've got to have your head in the game, right? 
in both sides of the business. The psychology is important. Okay? Personal development will enable you to have emotional intelligence. You know? And it's, it's tough. Being a business owner, being a trader, like I know we talk about on Instagram and we post nice things and we sound real cute and you can do it, guys. Oh, yeah, you can do it. But believe me, the days when I don't want to do it, I still show up. The days when I don't want to, you know, do certain things, that's the difference between winners and losers, right? And in the trading world, it's the same thing. Because you might have a bad day. You might have an argument with, your, with, with, with someone in your family. You might have an argument with your, with your friends, right? Or you might have a tough day. And you might just feel like, man, let me just go into the market and just give it one. Let me just place a big trade and just make some money. People self-sabotage all the time, okay? So the trading market, it takes patience, okay? Number two, rule of mindset, right? Is accept that the market will do what the market wants to do, okay? Very simple. The same way that when you wake up in the morning, the weather will be what the weather is going to be. Okay? The market would, like, people say, when people say, oh, he's a good trader, it's not really, you can't really say that. I, I'm gonna, you know, I don't just listen to things and just take it on board like always. No, it's not really true. Because you could be the best technical analysis trader in the world, but the market can, the market ultimately will do what it wants to do. The reason why we, the, the, what separates, what makes someone a good trader or a bad trader is the mentality they have. That's the only difference. Because some, yes, you, you can become technically good, of course. You can mark up your charts. You can do, you can do all of that. That's, I'm not saying that doesn't play a part. But success is 90% spiritual, 10% physical. So even the little strategies that you're doing, great. But that only makes up 10% of being a good trader. The other 90% is your mentality. So understand, you've got to, you've got to accept. You've got to accept. <laughs> We're living in London, right? Whoever lives in London. You guys will understand that if you wake up in the morning and it's not sunny, you've got to accept that the British, market, the British weather will do what the British weather wants to do. You can't tell the market, you can't tell the weather what to do. It, the market, the, the, I keep saying the market, the weather has a mind of its own, right? So understand that, right? Accept that the market will do what the market wants to do. Our goal is to, yes, get technically good. You have to, of course, get technically good. Learn how to use TradingView. Learn how to use uh, the app effectively, right? And at the end of the day, there's enough resources on the academy and on my YouTube channel, which is, a, I've got like 25 trading videos how many of you have been through all those videos? Probably none of you. I mean, hey, it's there. It's there. Right? People that are hungry, you're going to go on my channel and you're going to see how many videos I've done over the, over the past year on trading psychology, right? I hope, I hope at least one of you have watched all my videos, right? It, it, it will make me feel good, right? <laughs> but the reality of it is, the psychology is the most important thing. Okay? And you've got to treat trading like a business. Uh, and the reason why I'm doing this call is I'm preparing you guys. We're going to start doing boot camps. We're going to start having physical events, physical trading boot camps. Not no, just trading. No network marketing, just trading. Sit there, trade together, learn, right? So these are the things we're going to start doing moving forward. We're going to have several events like this, right? Team get-togethers, right? And it's going to enable your mindset to be stronger when you're around the other people that are also trading with you, okay? So number two is accept the market wants to do what it wants to do. The third one is a very important one, right? Zoom out in review. I'll explain what that means. While it's important to analyze the day-to-day -day trades you make if you only take this micro view, is it really possible to gauge the health of your trading plan on such a small scale? No. It's important that when you look at the health of your trading, that you look at your equity curve. So basically what you're saying is, you look at 
your the entire scope. You look at, you know, the strat again, a lot of you are using the app. Now, what's gonna happen is a lot of you are going to get good at trading where you can start placing your own trades without utilizing maybe the company's tools. Now, if you want to be a duplicatable person that's actually building a culture of trading, I would recommend that you don't promote that to your members. You promote to them, use the system. If you're trading by yourself and you're making money, great. And you can show your team. Obviously, I'm not saying you can't, but I'm saying creating duplication with the trading system, you want them to use the, the system that they're paying for. It enables retention to be stronger. You know, I looked at our numbers recently and we've had probably a 79% retention. No, we have had 79% retention in the past six months. So of every 10 customers that join my organization, right? Seven to six, I'll say seven, let's say seven of them stay for at least 90 days. That's because we have a culture. People are plugged in with the mindset course. They're plugged in with the trading, right? I'm, you know, most of you have messaged me directly on on WhatsApp. I respond with, with any uh, questions and queries. And if I haven't responded yet, I will respond tonight, okay? And, um, you know, it's very important to zoom out, all right? To zoom out and review and to look at your whole system. Look at, um, am I creating a duplicatable culture? Am I creating a system for the organization? Am I, not even, am I utilizing the system? Am I, um, you know, look at utilizing the app effectively? Am I posting my results, right, on the chat, right? Am I, uh, and again, then you're looking at your actual trading journey. Am I utilizing the compound calculator? I'm going to go through that in a little bit, right? Compounding your account day by day, right? Guys, look, compounding is quite boring. I'm going to be honest, right? We all want to make money right now. You know what I mean? Um... You all, we all want to make money now, right? Um, but those that will be here 90 days from now are those that understand uh, the importance of being extremely patient with, with the Forex market, right? Being patient with your own journey, okay? It's very, very important, all right? It's very, very important. Um, so zooming out, looking at what's happened, and then, you know, one thing that I learned from one of my mentors years ago, he said, uh, track and tweak. So track your progress, look at what's happened, and then tweak it, make adjustments, okay? Because you're only gonna get better. If you're uh, trading and you're, making, you're getting some results, you're utilizing the app, and you should start play, like, looking at the charts yourself, you should start doing your own analysis. That's the whole idea of it. But I'm just saying, if you're creating duplication, you want to make sure the system is being utilized. These calls are, should be utilized consistently. Plugging them into these calls, plugging them into the, the, the live sessions, okay? Some of you have been in this company for a month plus, and some of you probably haven't been in a li live session. You can't expect to be, like the people that you see on the testimony calls that are given the testimonies, they're the ones that are using the platform. It's very simple. It's not rocket science. Like we're not, we're not two years old. We're grown people, right? If you're utilizing the platform that you've paid for, that's why I stress it so much. Like I'm even more, I'm even, I'm even stressing myself out. Like I won't, are you watching the videos? I'm on to you guys case. Why? Because I understand that you have to plug in with the system, right? I said this on the call the other day. If you're not willing to do it, then don't just leave. Just do something else, right? Don't waste your money. And I'm, I'm not saying it in a, in, a, in, a, in a route, I'm saying it in an honest way. Don't waste your time. This is for those that want to win, right? And the platform has been set for that. So don't come to me saying, Derek, I'm not making money. Derek, I'm not. How many videos, how, how, are you plugging, plugging in with the system? And we've trained our leaders to the point where we don't, we don't sell dreams. I'm, I, I'm not going to guarantee you're going to make a thousand pound next month. I'm not saying that. I'm saying, but are you, and it's not even healthy to have that mentality. Oh uh, yeah. Cause you hear the stories. People are like, you know, they make, oh, I made 25, you know, I made, I made X amount of money and it's good. And I, I, I do enjoy those stories. The, the big amounts of money, but 
I want you guys to understand the average person probably won't do that. I must, the, I, I'm looking at the, 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 the newest person that comes in that doesn't have any experience, that has never ever seen a chart before. I want that person to feel like they can win. That's what's most important, right? And that's why we've created a system where, you know, I'm setting up the signals, we're using the app, right? I know the app has had, you know, it's been a bit, you know, it's been a, bit, a few, there's been probably less trades than, than it was before, but don't worry, you know, the company is, you know, uh, again, tracking and tweaking certain things and there will be a, a flood of trades coming through, especially after September when the company relaunches, there's going to be a lot of, you know, exciting things happening, uh, which I, I can rest assured you guys, Courtney Logan is the GOAT, right? He's, he's super good. And uh, when you guys see him in London, you guys will realize, you know, I mean, how, um, how 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 hungry he is to help us, right? Uh, succeed. So, guys, look, I'm being honest, guys. Utilize the platform, guys. Put in the chat box. I commit. If you're going to commit to watching at least one live session per day, right? Or at least at least one every other day. Put I commit in the chat. I commit. I want you. I'm doing it myself. I'm on, guys. I've got a thousands and thousands and thousands of people in my business, right? And I am on the sessions as well because I'm trying to make sure that I'm staying, I'm keeping sharp. I don't want you guys to feel like you're not getting the value that you've paid for. That that breaks my heart because I'm all about good customer service, right? I believe no one does it better than me when it comes to serving the team, customer service. You can ask anybody in the industry. Derek is the best at that. I will, I will, I will be on a call with you. I will make sure you're plugged in. I will, but I, I, I cannot have people not plugging in and then you're saying that you're not getting the. I'm not saying anyone has been saying that. I'm just saying if people, I mean, people in the past say, Derek, you know, I feel like I could be making more money. Well, then you've got to look at the people that are winning. What are they doing? Right? They're plugging in. Looking at Victoria, um, one of our leaders, man, she's been making money every day in the markets. £100 here, £200 here. And she's compounding her account. And, I'm, and she's making withdrawals consistently. This young lady's been in the company for a couple of months and she's doing that. Yes, she has experience. Yes, she's been in the, she was, she was in the um, IM Academy before. Yes, she was in a, a previous company. But still, she's had the most results she's ever had now. And yes, it is compounded growth over time. So yeah, that's, but then we've got new people that have come in and that have come in and absolutely crushed it. So I'm really wanting you guys to really, really, really take it seriously, right? And it leads me on perfectly to my next point. Cut out the noise. Okay? Don't let the, dis the distractions get the better of you. Right? Whether that's people's opinions. Right? Whether that's people's uh, doubts of you. Right? Cut out the noise. Right, I promise you it, it, it will do you the world of good. Cutting out the noise will completely change everything for you. Okay? To really focus in trading and, and, and you're building, some of you are building a team and you're trading, right? You've got to be completely focused. No time for distractions. You've got to be locked in. Right, you're gonna be locked in. That that that's that's just, a, uh, it's it's just a very very important. Right. It's very very important. Okay, to be focused. And this is why we say have a why, have your goal, why you're doing this. Re revisit your why over and over again. Everything is fun at the beginning. Over time, you have, to, you have to be disciplined. Discipline is absolutely everything, okay? Because at the very beginning, you're, you know, oh yeah, it's great. You, you go to an event, you know, I love events. Love, events are great, we've got an event coming up. But I'm already thinking about after the event, I wanna still be fired up. Like I went to events, trading events, right? 2020, 2019. I'm still fired up from that event. Every time I think about those events I attended, I still get excited. And when I think about those events, it forces me to go into action. The reason why I still get excited is because 
I made a decision that I was going to cut out all the noise. Okay? The, the last thing, the worst thing you can do is listen to some joker who has never traded in his life telling you, it's hard, bro. It's tough. It's going to... No, 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 no. Don't take... Only take someone's opinion if you're willing to trade places with them financially. Right? I'm not gonna, like, you got to understand. Some of you are saying, well, Derek, you know, I've, I've heard that trading... You might even hear that trading is easy. And that's not true. It's... It, it, it's, it, 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 you can make it easier when you're plugging in with the system. I'm not here to raise a group of hyped up people that are just gassed up about they can become millionaires tomorrow. I want people to understand this is a journey. Right? And you have to be patient with that. It's going to happen. You've seen the testimonials. You see people winning. It's, it's inevitable. And people are coming in and winning quickly. Yes. But even after you've won quickly, you have to sustain it. Uh, you know, I was, I was watching um, a clip of my favorite football player. You guys know who he is. The best player, my favorite player, of, I believe is the best player of all time, right? And you guys can argue that with your, you can argue that with yourself later. But I think Ronaldo is the greatest player to ever play the game. I just think he's the greatest player. I think he's in all areas of life, he is phenomenal. And I, I, I read a stat the other day that there was a football tournament in 2004 called Euro 2004. He's the last player that's still playing that played in that tournament. I mean, it's just bonkers when you think about it. Like this kid has been, he was a kid. I grew up with Ronaldo. I feel like I, feel like I know him. Because I've watched him play from 04 to 20 years I've been watching this guy play football. Right? And I, and I will meet him. I will meet him soon. I, I, I promise you I will meet him soon. Right? But the reason why I brought up Ronaldo was because he has longevity. There's players that came in, scored a couple goals, they won some trophies, and then they just, they just die down. And no one, no one remembers them. But Ronaldo, 20 years. 22 years you've been playing? 22 years? Consistently at the highest level? That's what I want. Like, let me know in the chat. Is that what you want? Do you want to be a, 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 a trader, a winner, a builder that's been doing this consistently year after year? Okay? Because some of you, sadly, came into the company and you were like, oh, I'm going to try it for a month. That's not going to work over here. It's not going to work... I'm, guys, I'm just being honest. It's not going to work. Your mentality has to be different. Do you start a relationship and you say, oh, oh, some, some of you that are married, you get married. Oh, yeah, I'm going to try it, marriage out for a month and see how it goes. You know, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm going to start, you know, that's not the mentality. I know it's a, different, it's, a, it's a totally different context to business, but it's still a decision you're making and you should be, that's why you've got to have a strong why. You've got to have a motivation to actually do it. Because trust me, there will be days when you do not want to do certain things. And discipline, cutting out the noise, will enable for you to keep winning. Okay? Hopefully you guys are getting the value. Now, next one is embrace the risk. Okay? You have to understand in trading that it's go there will be peaks and troughs. There will be wins, there will be losses. That's okay. The most important thing, right, is to embrace mentally that there is a risk that you're taking here. And in trading, we have something called a risk to reward ratio. So for example, if the stop loss is 30 pips, there's a 30 pip stop loss, and then take profit one, will be 30 pips. Take profit two will be 60 pips. Take profit three will be how much? 90 pips. So typically, what I tell people is, set the trade on the app to take profit two. What you're doing is, it's called a two to one risk to reward ratio. So for every one pip that you're willing to lose, you're willing to gain two for every one. Does that make sense? 
if you're going for TP3, that's three to one, right? So for example, if the market goes up, that's what I'm saying. You could never blow an account if you actually have risk management because if you have a certain lot size, right, and you might lose that those thirty, you might lose, you might it might hit stop loss. But if you can place another trade and it hits TP two, you've made back that money and some more. So psychologically, trading's actually yeah, it's it's, it's easier than it's easier than people think it is, but it's still not easy like to do overnight but here's the reality of it if you are actually trading right and you have that mentality the stop loss is always shorter than the take profit right so it, it, it it's a powerful concept because now what's happening is is you are you, you have a risk and you have to be okay i always tell people trade money that you're willing to lose if you lost the money, you're not going to get, you know, evicted from your house. Don't trade your mortgage money. Don't trade your car note. Don't trade, you know, don't, don't, don't go and sell your watch to trade it, the money. It doesn't make sense. That's not, it, guys, we've got to think as business people, right? And because in trading and network marketing, the money comes so easy. It, it, not easy, it comes so quickly. You don't have to be qualified to do this industry. You don't have to have any degrees. You just, just walk into a company, you can just make money overnight. But you, but it is a real business. People in, like my mentor, David Amanite, he makes more than any, like he, he's probably the highest paid person that I personally have a relationship with. He's been making a million dollars a month for a long time. So imagine I'm around someone that is probably the highest paid person I have a, I, I mean, everyone I have a close I have a lot of millionaire friends, but I have all my millionaire, he's probably the person that I have the closest relationship with. Someone that has three Rolls Royces, a million, you know, makes anything from half a million to a million dollars a month. I mean, come on, man, it's, it's next level, right? So it's like, but guys, embracing that risk, be willing, like, don't over leverage and don't trade money that is like like you got you got to put money aside treat it like a business right treat it like an actual like have a, how many of you have a balance sheet i've got i've got a i've got a spreadsheet for my trading i've got a balance sheet i've got a trading journal i've got a book for my personal finances i've got a book for me and katrina's family finances everything is accounted for every penny that i spend is accounted for in my life if i buy you know a, a, a bottle of water for one pound fifty i'm gonna put that on my list of expenses i don't play around with money because i respect money that's why money respects me money is always coming to me because i respect it and i i treat it good whatever you treat good with gratitude will continue to have a relationship with you and this is the same thing about trading. Some of you are not, again, some of you are new. I'm not, I'm not being too harsh on you guys, right? But, um, you know, you want to you wanna, you wanna invest in a trading journal. Okay? You want to definitely invest in a trading journal. The journal will allow you to look at your, your, your record and really pay attention to what's been happening in your trading journey so far okay looking at the wins looking at the losses etc etc okay now we're almost done no when to cash out this is a big one um be happy with the profits that you're in if you're in profit and, and you feel like, you know, it, it's, it's, and that's why you got to have a daily target. If you're compounding your account and you're in profit by a certain amount of money and, it's, and it is within that 3 to 5% that we always talk about, guys, close out the trade. Close out the trade. Don't worry. Like, you've made your money. You can make more tomorrow. Okay? Never, ever feel like there's a shortage of money in the world. There's enough money to go around for everybody. 
that make sense? I don't feel like I'm missing out on anything. You know? There's always someone that's going to make more than you. There's always someone making less than you. That's how the world is. But ultimately, money is an infinite supply. Right? So in trading, if you're in profit and you're happy with it, close the trade. It doesn't have to, guys, you don't have to wait until the trade hits take profit, you know. Sometimes it will. And even the app, when if, an, if the app gives a trade and, you know, you're in profit and you don't want to wait until TP, close it out. It's okay, close it. Be happy. You know, today I was in profit and uh, I've got my daily target, what I want to make each day. I, it hit a certain amount and I was happy with it. I said, you know what? No problem. I'll take that. Cash it out. Because I understood it's not about trying to get every penny out of the market. Sometimes just be happy with what you have. Just be grateful. Okay? Next one is know when you're wrong. Know when you're wrong. And that's why you have to have a trading journal. Okay? Think like a winner. This, this again, this goes back to what I was saying to you guys before. Um, having a mindset, um, having a complete guys, trading has completely changed my life. Not just because of trading itself, but just the industry. Because in the trading world, there's so many different avenues of income you can make from the trading world. It's a phenomenal space to be in. Yes, it has it. It has its risks, and I think people have people are skeptical about it because of the lack of integrity. People in trading, they they you know, there's a lot of scoundrels out there that will do anything to to uh, make money from you in the trading space. But we've come with a, a vision like Envision You, the way that we're doing it, the right way. We have the right integrity, the right heart. Um, it's an incredible industry. It really, really is, uh, you know, it's money aside, it's just a wonderful space. You can really, you can start thinking bigger, right? And that leads me on to my next point, which is it's a market without limits. Start to understand that this is a market without limits. If you want to become a billionaire from trading, you can do that. If you want to make a million pound a year from this industry, from trading alone, you can do it. But read, read, read up. Go from the beginning again. You see, there's several things you have to do. Okay. Trading routine. Now this is a big one. Um. Wearing comfortable clothing when you're trading. I wouldn't trade in a suit. I would like I like to wear track suit bottoms or something. I like to be comfortable. Don't trade after an argument. Don't trade after if you, if you're pissed off at somebody. Don't 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 trade. Okay. If you are tired, stressed, you you just come off a flight. You know, be careful. If you're, if you're using the app, if you're placing my bonus signals, yes, you can do that. That's different. But if you're actually looking for setups yourself, or you're, 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 and even then, if you're placing a trade, but you're pissed off with somebody, you might just over leverage that account and just like, oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to risk. I'm going to risk so much money. I don't even care. Right? And then you just start going crazy. And then you start revenge trading. Okay? That's my next point. No revenge trading. Okay? Revenge trading is when you are... 
consistently trying to fight the market. The market is like a big beast. This, the market is a beast. You can't win. Imagine trying to fight Mike Tyson. Even now, some of, you, some of us will lose. He's 60 years old and he would knock us. I think he would knock me out. I don't think I can beat up Mike. Even today, Mike Tyson is what, 61 years old? And I will probably lose a fight to Mike Tyson. Imagine trying to square up to Anthony Joshua. Hey, yo, bro. Hey, hey, come on, man. Come on. It's, it's not going to end well for us, guys. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. The Forex market doesn't care about your little thousand pound in your account. He doesn't. The market doesn't care. I don't know if the market is a, is a, is a you know, how old the market is or, you know, the, the gender of the market. I don't know. What I know is the market is a, is a, is a person that the market is a, is a, is is like a, is like a person. It has a personality, and the personality of the market is completely stoic, cold faced, doesn't smile, doesn't cry, doesn't talk. It just acts. It just does what it does. And so, when you're trading, guys, track your progress. Don't rush the process. I know we have the monthly membership. I understand that, and that's why you want to make. That's why we have the networking side because it can offset that monthly membership. It just creates a leverage point. I'm not forcing anyone to build a team, but I'm saying, hey, listen, if you know a few people and, you're, and you like the service you've got from the company, which you, you definitely will like the service, and I'm sure all of you do like the service from the company, right? And you believe it can help somebody else, that's when you start building that community and you start helping other people to get on board with this company. And when you do that, you start making residual income. And when you make residual income, you can now pay for your membership and you can now invest it back into the Forex market. That's really the trick of it, okay? It's having that extra source of income to do that, okay? But if you wanna make it strictly from trading, then you've gotta compound your trading account. Okay, and I'm going to show you guys right now how to actually uh, successfully compound your account. Okay, let's see here. I'm going to show you guys right now how to do that. You have to log in to. Daily compound calculator, okay? Very, very simple. You, um, let's say you're starting at 250. And you're growing your account by 5%, even, even, you know, even let's, say, let's say 5% on the high end, right? 90 days, three months, okay? Imagine compounding, making 5% a day which is you know it's kind of on the high end let's say even if we're even if we say even if we say three percent on the low low end right you've grown your account from 250 to 1758 pounds in three months now obviously we know it's not going to be this exact number because the market has you know, again there's ups and downs right but even if you even if you hit half of that even if you made you know, five, six, uh, 800 pounds. In 90 days, you're telling me from 250, just doing a couple of trades, 3% a day, right? This is on the, a very realistic amount of money, right? We can talk about all the big, the big amounts as well, but look at this, right? The first day, you make 750. Now that, that's, that, that's not sexy to a lot of people. Ah, oh, Derek, seven fifty. No, no, no. You don't understand. That's a big deal. You put that two fifty in your little bank account, and see how much money comes out tomorrow. Right? See how much money it grows by. See how much interest that you make on that. Seven fifty. And you grow it day by day. Use this website, guys. This website will change your life. I'm telling you. I'm using it right now for my trading accounts. And it's working. It's, 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 it's absolutely working. People are 
you know, I'm, I'm, I'm blown away at the results. I'm growing. It. And, and when it gets to that number that I want it to be at, you'll hear about it and you'll see it. But right now, I'm compounding it and I'm growing. I'm following the same plan that I'm telling you guys to follow. Okay? So, the compounding is absolutely crucial. Gives you a chance to look at the different days. You know, September, you know. You, you look through the entire month. Look at your progress. And you can start growing your account, guys. It's so crucial. As you're trading, you're looking at the progress. And it gives you... And, you know, it's, it's a good feeling, right? You know, your presentations will be different when you've, when you've been compounding. You, you know, you're, you're talking a little bit different on these calls, right? Why? Because you're making some money. You're utilizing the platform that, you're, that, 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 that you've paid for. I want you, I, you know, I, I really care about you guys, uh, your money, your, your heart. I know, I know a lot of, all of you work very hard for your money right you work super hard for you got some of you got kids some of you got you know spouses husbands wives you know you got people that you got people that you provide for i know how that feels i'm the i'm the main provider for my entire family i understand the pressure but that's why you're doing this you're doing this so you can be a winner you're doing this so you can change your life don't ever forget why you started, right? Don't ever forget why you started doing this. Please don't ever forget that. Get all the hype, all the Instagram, TikTok, all that rubbish. Okay, whatever. We hear about this guy that, oh, I bought a Lamborghini. Okay, great. No problem. I'm not talking about all the over, over, over exertion of marketing. I'm talking about the real world. You and I in, this, in the real world right now, you're sitting in your house right now. You probably are not making the money you want to make. You're probably not living the lifestyle you want to live. You probably, you know, I was there. Some of you are in that place where you can afford whatever you want. Some of you can't. And if you cannot, then... This is gonna. This is your ticket. This can be. It's not the only way you can do it. You can do it. There's several other things, you, but this is a way that you can actually you utilize. And this is your chance, guys. I'm telling you right now. September the third, we're amping up the business in all areas: trading, business, uh, everything. Right. And this is your chance, guys, to be a part of history, guys. So, get yourselves on this train. If you haven't gone through the academy. Guys, go on the academy tonight. Watch five videos at least and post it in the trading chat. If you're when you're going through the education, post it in the trading chat. Let you because when you're doing that, you're in, you don't know who you're gonna encourage. When you post your results in the chat, when you post, you know, your 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 the um, I'm on I'm on the academy, I'm on the live sessions. It is going to guys. I'm telling you, I've been doing this for a long time. I understand there's someone on that chat. We've got 400 plus people on that chat. There's somebody in that chat right now that is struggling. That's probably about to quit. And God has positioned you in, in this business maybe just to help them. And obviously other people too, but I care about that person. I don't, it's not all about the rah-rah. Anyway, everyone likes the rah-rah, right? That's great. But how about the person right now that's sitting in their house, that's probably depressed, stressed, broke, has no money. That person needs that one test, that one video. Hey guys, watch this video. Hey guys, jump on this call. That's, that's what, because if we can help, the, the, they always say you're as strong as your weakest link. So if you can help the person that's struggling the most and lift that person up. Because I was once there, right? I was once there when I was, completely down and out you know when i started this industry when i started seven years ago i was like stuttering when i was talking i was lacking confidence i had been in prison for a year i was messed up and i and i had people in the chat that were firing me up i remember my my first promotion and i remember how i felt and i remember people's results in the trading chat i remember that 2017 
and I go back to the, I still got some of those chats on my phone and I go back and I look at the result, I look at the people that got promoted. And you know, a lot of them are coming over to envy you now. I'm calling all of them. I'm like, hey, you remember me? Yeah, you remember Derek? Yeah, come over, right? But listen, like I'm telling you right now, get active, get proactive. And listen guys, I'm telling you, it's the days when you don't want to do it that counts the most. It's not when you want to do it that, no, when you want to do it, anybody can do that. But what separates the winners from the losers are the people that do it when they don't want to do it. You think, listen, not every winner, there's times when they, but they have to be disciplined. You might have a, 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 a trade that comes up and you, and you know you've made your target for the day and you know, oh, I could take that trade. But you don't have to because you've already hit your target. If you've hit your target for the day, guys, don't trade anymore. That's it. That like, no, no, just leave it alone. If I put a bonus signal in the chat, but you've made your target for the day, do not touch that trade because it's not guaranteed it's going to win. And even if you do win, happy days. But you want to get yourself into the habit of focusing on discipline. So guys, promise me, right? Promise yourself, promise your family. If you've made, guys, you start with 250 today, all right, and you make 750 tomorrow, do not trade anymore. I don't care if a thousand trade comes, do not do it. Now, here's my, here's my thing. If you're using a demo account, you can be, a, obviously you can be a little bit more liberal. And here's my thing. If you lose two trades in a row, stop for the day. Okay, once you've made your target. Now, if you're using a, now here's the thing though. If you're using, for example, 0 0.05, right? Or yeah, for a trade and you win that trade by 30 to 50 pips. If you play some more trades, you can if you want, but just use a, use a smaller lot size. That's the truth, that's the key. So if you're doing 0 0.05, and then a couple, I, I mean, it, I would advise not to keep trading, but if you want to, Use 0 0.01, 0 0.02. And it's like, if I lose it, cool. I've, I've still in profit for the day. That's the key, it's compounding. Now with the app, cause there are, to be honest, there are kind of minimal trades right now. Take as many as the trades as you can. Once you've made your target for the day, I, I'll rephrase it. I would recommend to stop trading, but if you want to take every trade that, that the app has, by all means do that. But just know that your risk is gonna be different. And if you do decide to take more trades after you've made your profit, then all you have to do is just minimize your lot size. All right, guys? So listen, I'm excited, man. It's 10 p.m., I've got more, more calls to do. But I appreciate you guys so much. I hope you guys got value today. I know it was very, very different from our normal calls, but I like to jazz it up, you know? to make it, you know, every week will be different. There'll be new value, new content, and we'll make sure we keep jazzing it up until we go to the beaches and the banks. God bless you guys, and I'll see you guys at the beaches and, of course, the banks. God bless you guys. Good night.